Hi guys, today I am doing a holiday gift guide and as you can tell by the title, a giveaway. And I've only done like a very, very, very small amount of giveaways on my channel. They're usually something very small. But this one is actually not, I don't want to say it's huge because I don't really have the finances to do that. But I worked with one brand for this and I also just wanted to throw some stuff together to say thank you to you guys. I just really appreciate those of you who normally watch my videos and support me and I just wanted to give back and it's the holiday time. So now's the time to do that. So in this video, I'm going to do a gift guide so I'm going to give you a few ideas for gifts for people I've done this before I'll leave old ones below but there are some things I have some gifts for friends for boyfriend girlfriend gifts and parents stuff like that so I'm gonna do that and then stay tuned till the end if you want to find out about the giveaway most of it is beauty related just so you know it's not anything like you know an iPad or anything like that stay tuned to the end of the video for that and all the info for the giveaway the rules when it closes all that stuff will be in the description box if you are interested we're gonna get into the gift guide and then I'll talk about the giveaway part later. Okay, so the first gift is for someone who's a friend. Like whether it's a girlfriend, cousin, sister, that kind of thing. This is, I feel like, really great gifts if you want to have a best friend or a regular friend or whatever, and you want to get a gift for them, but you don't want to go like, you know, you're not trying to spend $50, but you're also not trying to spend like $5, and you just want something that's nice, that proves that you've thought about them, that you want to give them something you think they're really gonna like, they're gonna use. You also don't want it to be something too like practical. I know that's something that I always struggle with, is like I want someone to use the gift I got them but I also don't want it to be so practical it's like a Starbucks or Dunkin Donuts gift card that like obviously they're gonna use it but it doesn't really show them that I thought about it that much it's just like okay you know so my gift idea here is skincare and I know skincare is very particular to each person obviously you could do those gift sets that they have at Sephora or Ulta because you're trying so much different stuff and it's really cool and I do think those are really great ideas are usually a really good value but sometimes my thing about buying those is that as much as I might want to try those expensive products now if this person really likes something they're gonna have to go out and spend $50 probably on the full size of that not everyone wants to do it not everyone has the budget to do that so one skincare item I think is really great for anyone is a face mask now I wouldn't go so far as to like you know assume that you know someone's skin type unless you're obviously close friends you know they complain about pimples or dry skin or something but I think face masks are always a good go-to gift because it's a gift that they don't need necessarily. It's not something they would buy for themselves always, but it's nice. It's a pampering thing that they could, they want that's gonna give them that nice time to relax and everything like that. So I have a few face masks I wanted to throw out there that I think would be good for any skin type. So the two face masks I'm gonna recommend here, although there's millions I've talked about on my channel before, I'll link my favorite face mask video below if you're interested in other ones. These are from the brand Perfectly Posh, which is such a fantastic brand. They've worked with me on this, so I'm and giving away a couple of the products I'm going to be mentioning so that's really exciting. They have really great products, they're all cruelty free, they have vegan options, they're made in the US so they're a really great company. First of all I'll leave their website below if you're interested. I would really recommend these for gifts because they're masks. I love them first of all. I've tried I want to say a handful, five or six of them and I love all of them for different things. Two of these are my two all-time favorites that I think would be great whether you have dry skin, oily skin, acne prone skin, literally whatever I think you'll like these and they're also a really good price range. They're in like the 15 to 18 dollar range so you're not going to Sephora prices 25, 30, 40 and you're not going to like the drugstore like three or four dollars so I think it's a really happy medium to get a friend gift. My two all-time favorites are the Calling All Fairies Exfoliating Sponge Sugar Mask. It looks like this. It's so cute. They all have this really cool texture from this brand. I don't even know how to describe it. They're all kind of like clay masks, like they dry up, but they also like feel, when you apply them, they don't feel how a clay mask feels. They're not really thick like that. They're very much more of like a moisturizer, almost like you're applying a thick moisturizer on your face that just won't absorb. And then as it dries, when you leave it on for five to 10 minutes, it almost absorbs into your skin. So when you first apply it, it's opaque, like a normal mask would be. But as it dries down, you can see your skin through it. It's so weird. But this one I really, it is exfoliating, but it doesn't have little beads or little like particles in it. So if you're sensitive to exfoliating or you find that exfoliating sometimes to you is like really irritating or you have sensitive skin, this is great because it exfoliates and it makes your skin feel so soft and smooth, but it doesn't have all those particles in it. There's something in it that makes your skin feel exfoliated, but doesn't feel like you're scrubbing at your skin. I would really recommend that. And this is one of the products I'll be giving away. And the other one you guys may have seen on social media. Actually, I think both of those I posted on social media when I tried them. But this one is my favorite. This is the In a New York Minute 
fast facial it is a face mask and it's kind of similar in texture to that one and they look very similar they're both like a whitish color the texture is so much different than any mask i've ever tried but this one is so great it's natural effective glycolic treatment comes in a little pot like this and i absolutely love this one i don't even know how to describe what this one does this is kind of like i don't think it's gonna like clear up your acne or like you know make an intensive difference if you have like some kind of an issue but whether you have dry skin acne prone skin oily skin dry skin mature skin i think this is really going to help you out especially if you have like a long day of wearing makeup ahead or you have like a long week ahead or you just finished a long week it's that kind of mask that's just going to like really change like it's going to give you a subtle change when i rinse this off not only does my skin feel like a baby's butt i mean like softer than a baby's butt like a clean fresh born baby's butt um <laughs> That was weird, but it feels so smooth and soft, but it also just glows on the inside. And I feel like it's really great after you've been wearing makeup all week long just to get a nice cleanse to your skin. It's also, I think, even better for before or not, like a long week of makeup. You might have work all week, like a really long days or something like that. I don't know what you guys do, but depending on what you're doing, do this. It's a great way to pamper yourself and relax. All these masks really are. I mean, I'm a huge face mask person, as a lot of you guys know. This one is my all-time favorite. This is going to be in the giveaway as well, so... How exciting. Another product I think would be a great gift for a girlfriend or something like that would be a body butter. And I know that's kind of like down the line of like perfume, body spray, but there's a reason people constantly give them as gifts to the to friends because they're really great and they are pampering and they are the kind of things like you normally don't buy yourself lotion that smells really nice i feel like well at least i don't i normally buy myself like the lotion from like the drugstore so when i get like a nice scented fragrance like thing i get it usually from friends and i love that because i use them and it's great and it's like a little treat perfectly posh also sells body butters and they smell so good they're also really nice thick texture they absorb really really fast so there's literally no greasy residue the honey honey healing body cream that's the one. Oh my god it smells like straight up gummy bears i think that's a great gift for any of your friends who like sweets who like smell like with the sweet scents also was super moisturizing but like the scent actually lasts i've tried so many lotions and body butters that just the scent doesn't last on your skin this one literally lasted like more than 12 hours and i literally anytime i smelled myself i'd be like oh my god i smell like gummy bears i'm not even joking guys i know it sounds weird and like why would you want to smell like gummy bears but it's great and i love it and i really recommend their body butters last but not least i think great products for friends if you don't want to go the face mask route if they're not really into that if they don't do so much skincare I think hair product is really great and one product from Perfectly Posh which I think is my number one favorite of everything I've tried from them which is a lot is the Enchantress hair serum. This one not only has heat protectant in it, but it keeps your hair feeling very, very soft, moisturized, especially at the ends. It's super lightweight too though, so whether you have thin hair, thick hair, whatever, I really think it's going to help. It doesn't feel greasy, it doesn't feel heavy, and it smells so good. I love it. Oh my god, it's amazing. This is also going to be in the giveaway, so yay. So those are the gifts for friends, girlfriends, that kind of thing. Next is like a great gift for, I think, really anyone, but I think it's a really great gift for siblings, cousins, and boyfriend, girlfriend. I think this is a great gift for boyfriend, girlfriend, especially if you're not at that stage where it's like jewelry, like expensive gifts, like technology. Like if you're starting to date someone, especially like, you know, during this kind of season and you're just starting to date them, but you have to get a Christmas gift, but you don't want to get them a gift card, but you also don't want to get them an iPad, you know, you're not there yet don't want to invest that much money i think these are some great gifts and they're throwback gifts and what that means is just kind of things from your childhood i'm assuming the person you're dating is around your same age ish but 90s gifts i think are such awesome things because when you open a gift like that on christmas it just brings out the child and you, know, you want to open it you want to get those scissors cut that gift open and start playing it putting it together and i think that if you give someone your age now a gift like that it just brings back that like childhood so some gifts ideas would be like a sega game set and that i think is only like 50 bucks i think i got it for my sister actually for her birthday one year from i think it was urban outfitters but they sell a lot of this stuff on amazon you just get like an old game set and like i know the real old ones are kind of expensive but like they've remastered them now so they're cheaper and they're just kind of like a remake of that but any game like that any kind of board game is such a great idea any board game you played when you were a kid like guess who pretty pretty princess and i know it's not something you're probably going to do all the time but it can even start up like a game night with your friends I, mean, I know it sounds kind of cheesy but it's fun i mean how many times as an adult have you played a game whether it was with a kid or not and you, you just have such a great time i think that throwback gifts are really great like right here i have like a rubik's cube a bop it stuff like that and i just it brings back childhood but i think this kind of a thing is awesome because you guys can do it together it's really fun you can like make a whole thing out of it also if you're gonna do that a lot of those things are on amazon i will link a couple ideas below but if you're gonna buy anything from amazon this time of year i would really recommend using amazon smile 
smile i don't know if you've heard of it i hope you have but instead of going through amazon it's literally amazon it's just called like smile.amazon.com and all you do is do your normal shopping but every time you do it'll go like a, a percentage or they'll make a donation to your charity of cho choosing so i chose um aspca you can obviously choose any different you know charity that's on the list but you don't have to spend any any extra money it's completely free it's just every time you go through there they will make that donation and i think whether it's one percent of your purchase or what i think it's a really great opportunity what i do is keep it in my bookmarks so that i don't forget to go through it because i have when i first started it so now i keep it up in my bookmarks so every time i go to amazon i just click it there and it works i think this time of year is a great time to do that i mean also just all year round there's no reason not to since it's free so definitely check that out also if you're doing online shopping which probably you are for these kinds of like throwback toys and games and stuff you're gonna want to go through ebates if you don't already know what ebates is i've talked about it a million times i always bring it up this time of year because you can save a ton of money you get a check at the end of i think three or four months of all the money you build up it's kind of like an online shopping mall you can pretty much just download their little like button into your bookmark thing and you click on it every time you go to a store and it like redirect you right to the same website it's completely free you just make an account you can recommend people to it and like if they sign up you get like some money but some websites have two percent cash back some have six some have eight this time of year a lot go up to like 12 15 so if you're spending a decent amount of money you get a decent amount back i'd really recommend using ebates i'll have the link below if you want to sign up okay the next one is that person who's impossible to shop for now this is whether it's your mother-in-law cousin your mom anyone like that kind of like an aunt like anyone who you kind of you know them and you want to get them something great but you don't know them well enough to get them something super personal you don't want to spend a ton of money because you're you know in your 20s and you probably don't have a job <laughs> just kidding but you know what i mean i think this is the kind of person that you normally get a candle for and that's totally fine who doesn't love a good candle i know i do so if you are going to get them a candle don't spend an arm and leg definitely go to tj maxx or marshall's i would recommend all your holiday shopping whether no matter what you're getting someone to go to those stores because you are going to get the best deal but if you don't want to get someone a candle or just something that's a bit different something a bit more personal and might even probably be cheaper than a candle would be go to tj maxx marshall's target walmart and get a nice picture frame print out a photo whether it's of them and their child if it's like your mother-in-law you know maybe a picture of her with like your boyfriend or whatever if the gift's for your mom a picture of you and your mom anything like that because i feel like a picture frame is simple just because you went through the effort of printing out a picture putting it in there i just think that that's really nice it's a bit more nice than a candle to be honest so depending on who you're getting it for obviously like make the picture about them like whether it's a whole family picture or whatever there's obviously so many pictures you can see online on facebook but it's nice to have photos around your house it's something i like to do also if you don't want to do that because you don't have pictures then or you think it would be kind of like too personal you don't know them that well but you want to get something nice get a blanket and i know that sounds weird but instead of a candle I think another cozy gift that is something that you don't actually have to like light and set on fire and know some people are very weird about candles get them a blanket you can go to walmart or target get super cheap blanket for like 15 bucks even tj maxx marshall's get a nice fuzzy one that matches i'd say go with gray everyone likes gray gray is in gray is matches everything i just think that that's such a cozy gift and i know like you might open a blanket and be like oh a blanket mm. but if you get them a nice cozy blanket it's something that they don't just have to use at christmas time i know a lot of people's go-to gift this time of year is like you know santa salt and pepper shakers or santa this and santa that but like they really can't use it till next year they're probably gonna put it away and forget about it so if you get them a blanket it's not only something they can use in winter it's something they can use all year long they just throw it on the edge of their sofa on their bed and it's great it's so cozy i love to get a blanket i never have enough blankets if you're like me and you love just like cozying up with a nice blanket you can never get enough and i think that's a great gift for anyone really i think those are really great gifts if you just wanted to skip the candle route but if you do that's fine too. My last gift is something I feel like I mention this every year, but I'm gonna mention it again in case you didn't see my video last year. But if you're really struggling with a gift idea, you know, you don't want to get anyone something really big, you're kind of low on cash. If you want to get something really great for your boyfriend or girlfriend or something, and you just can't like seem to think of like the best gift and you, you know they're gonna do something great and you just can't like think of it, or you're struggling, it's last minute, anything like that, I think the best gift is to buy a ton of stuff they like and put it in a basket. And I know that kind of sounds cheesy and I know it's not, it doesn't sound like, oh, Oh my god you got them on ipad but it's a very personal gift and it proves that you know them and you can make these themed you know you can do like if you want to get them tickets to a show or even just like movie tickets if you guys love going to the movies get them tickets get them some microwave popcorn get them a gift card for netflix or something like that i don't know red box i don't know how they do that get them their favorite candy you throw a bunch of stuff together you could do a date night one you could even throw in like a little coupon book i know those are cheesy but i think that that's so sweet you know a coupon book i'll give you a back massage or you know 
movie night on you or like three veto movie nights if I pick the movie and you don't like it you can veto it like things like that just like cute little things that just kind of show that you know them that it's kind of just like about your relationship and I think it's really cute it's kind of like a DIY but it's, it doesn't take much it takes some like tissue paper and some ribbon and it's easy and it's quick and you still put a lot of thought into it and obviously it shows you know them and you care about them that is an idea okay, so now to the giveaway portion of this video I'm so excited about this so I did tell you that some of the things that you're gonna be getting in this giveaway if you win are gonna be the perfectly posh New York minute face mask calling all fairies face mask and the enchantress hair serum as well as a little thing of other flow packets and a couple other little you know things that you can try out from the brand I'm also throwing in a few other things I'm not gonna tell you it's gonna be a surprise but a few more beauty products that I think you guys might be interested in things that I think you might really like so I just I'm really really excited about this thank you to perfectly posh by the way for giving me some extra things to throw in here I'd really recommend checking them out and like seeing if you'd like anything I find it hard to believe if you would go on the site and not want something because the packaging is cute everything is so great and the fact that they're cruelty free and everything like that is just like an extra plus so definitely check them out I would really recommend it in order to enter the enter the giveaway which is what you've all been waiting for you do have to be subscribed to my channel so just hit that button down there or wherever it is you also have to be following me on Twitter an extra entry entry will be on Instagram if you follow me there the way you enter will be just to leave a comment on this video telling me what your favorite idea was I mentioned or what you want for Christmas anything kind of around that general idea and then just like put like I'm entering and also leave your Twitter tag thingy your Twitter handle is that what's called I know a lot of people don't have Twitter if you don't then just like write that in the comment section and let me know where I can contact you but you put your Twitter your Instagram I'd appreciate Twitter is like the easiest way for me to contact you whoever wins will be chosen completely like randomly and I will leave in the description box when this giveaway is gonna be closed because I haven't decided that yet I think it'll be up for like a week and a half because so, I do want to get you this stuff before Christmas oh also this is only in the US so I am sorry if you are not from the US I feel really bad but this is only a US giveaway because I honestly I just can't afford to ship a box that's full of heavy stuff to the UK or like you know any other country that might, might be watching me so I am sorry I do hope to do an international one at some point so I just really wanted to say thank you to you guys I just keep getting such nice comments from you guys on like Instagram and like everything and I just really appreciate it I wish all of you could win I wish I could literally send each of you something but that would be so expensive and if you know me I'm not about spending all that money if you forgot what I said or I didn't make any sense all of the rules for the giveaway will be below but I hope you got some great ideas from this gift guide if you are going to use any of them let me know good luck in the giveaway I really hope that you guys are happy I'm doing this thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. I don't even know what I'm doing. Sorry, I have a hair and I'm wearing red lips, so this could get messy. Sorry, I have an itch.